Ready to go outside. This came in today. This is good stuff. Uh, this is almost like a um, maple syrup thickness. And uh, I use it quite a bit. Number 16. And I also use number 4. Which is back there. Number 4 is like water. I mean it's like water thin. So it's, it's really thin stuff. Uh, so if you haven't got something to uh, put it on with, uh, it, it's going to be a mess. <coughs> How I found out about that, I don't know if you guys ever watched the program Tanked. It's where they make all these custom fish tanks. Well, I watched them making going back a couple of years now making a tank and they've got this stuff and they just and it seals the tank boom done so, wow what the hell are they using so I get on the uh, online I get to their website and I get a hold of one of the guys that run the shop called redneck and uh, I asked him hey redneck uh, what do you guys use for your epoxies or your glues or whatever it is you're using and he emailed me back and said those is what he used. So I bought a couple and I've been using it ever since. So now it doesn't work on everything. If you're going to buy it, read up on it. Uh, but other than that, it uh, seems to be pretty good stuff. Now, with that being said, let me... Uh, what time is it anyway? It's noon time. Today is uh, Wednesday. I got a meeting tonight. I got to get ready for that too. All right, so let's go out here, get some of these wires tied up, get the trailer moved out of the way. I put all the air in the tires, so it's time to get that out of the way for now. I still haven't wired the uh, wire or a plug to the van yet, so wiring is not a big deal at this point. But there's that. I put one there and I put one on the other side. I remounted the light with this plate up here. And... Uh, so we're pretty well set with most of that stuff. And I did the same thing on this side. And I had to move this as well. So now that's there. So now I can just roll those down and not worry about it. Uh, but for now, let me get some of this stuff out of the way. Hold on a minute. Get that off there. That. Charger. Okay, so I think I should be okay to get this trailer moved in the back. <coughs> so here's the wire here. And here's the wire here. So it's not a big deal as far as the wire goes. Same thing on this side. Besides, like, like I said on the van, I haven't got anything wired there either, so. Alright, let's see. I should be able to get through there. So let's see what we can come up with here. Power washer came out the other day. Put you on the John Deere can.
not going to put it, the trailer away away because I got to go up to the club again next week. So uh, we'll take care of it then. I'm just going to uh, get all that out of the way. I'm going to make some room for it. Pull some of this crap in. Or not in as much as out. So. <coughs> It'll be easier. I'm plugging here. There's a big old 30 amper. With a 30 amp cord. The welder. Uh, okay, that takes care of that. Pull in the uh, airline here. Uh, hold on, guys. Sorry about that. Jeez. It's longer than I thought. <laughs> Actually, it isn't that long until you start climbing up 50 feet. 50 feet on the ground is one thing. 50 feet in the air is a whole other story. Alright, so let me throw this out here for now. And then I'll go out there and pick it up later. I go out to get the welder. Okay, so we're all done there. Put this over in front of this for now if I get a chance to coil that up. Alright, so. Now, let me see here. Put this away. My toe is still driving me cuckoo. good cleaner that stuff there uh, I get a tractor supply because they're the cheapest place for it uh, but uh, it's good stuff I mean you can dilute it if you want and it, even then it works good but uh, it's good stuff I used to use that to clean the bilge in my boat uh, and at one time I mean it straight it'll even start taking dead skin off your hands so my wife can't use it because uh, the smell it takes her breath away. So uh, if she's going to use it, I, I dilute it like uh, one part of that to like four parts of water. Uh, all right, I'm going to go in the house for a minute. I'll be right back out. I want to uh, check something with the wife. I'll be right back.